So the first host just left and um, we've got about another half an hour to go before we leave. Weather looks good. We've got fair winds for a start, coming from behind, up to about 17 knots overnight tonight. Um, second boat's just on his way out now. So, final last rush. Boats are all packed up. Two have now left. And we're all getting there. How you doing, guys? Let's stand's nearly ready to go. Have you got a time? Time to go? Excellent. Line ashore. That would be great. Yeah. All good this side. Clearer lines. All clearer lines. All good.
quite small actually. Just in front there. Jennifer up now and that sail hopefully will be up all night Not me too The sun's getting lower in the sky, it's getting a little bit cooler. We're all dressed up in a few more clothes. Got the pod dolphins back. And we've just put the Jennifer up. Um, winds are set to be light for the rest of the night. But we'll see how it goes. We're up we're on shift from seven this evening until one in the morning. And yeah, the wind's a bit all over the place, but the sea swell is what's uh, causing the chaos at the moment. And yeah, it's been a good day so far. Any problems, any issues? Absolutely none whatsoever. No, it's been great. Now we've got the sail up and... Uh, engine off. Engine yeah. off. So we had 7 hours, 20 minutes of engine, which is quite a long time, but there just wasn't enough wind. But we've only got 7 knots of wind, we've yeah. got 7 knots of wind. Hence the Jenica. But yeah, what a lovely evening. Oh, oh wow! Tea time on a radiance. Time. Well done, guys. First night. How are you all feeling? Yeah, good. I'm good, yeah. We've got the uh, Jenna Crop. We're doing about 5.2 knots with uh, nine knots of wind. And we're just about to smoke a mono. Excellent. <laughs> Not often that happens. <laughs> Dolphins beside us. Yeah, and beautiful, sunset. Beautiful, sunset. beautiful sunset. And we're having a curry for tea, which we'll show you in a minute. Beautiful sunset out there. So the sun has gone into nighttime mode, eating a great big cur What are you eating? What are you like? Lemon puffs? I don't know. Just eating you a massive curry. Me. Massive curry. I know, but I couldn't resist having one. <laughs> I've not had them for about 20 years. I don't know. Just going to have a cup of tea and um, yeah, shift change soon. Well, we're on our first night shift. Um, our shift is from 7 o'clock in the evening through to 1 in the morning. So far, so good. Um, had to change course by about 13 degrees in total because the uh, Jenica that was out wasn't holding on to the wind. The wind came directly behind us, so we've had to alter course. But we're doing good, four and a half to five knots at the minute, which is brilliant. Um, still quite slow speed, really, because there's hardly any wind. But everything's gone quite smoothly. No ships around. Um, nice full moon out tonight. And yeah, we're all good. So we've got another two hours to go and then we're uh, off to bed, which we're looking forward to now. Seven thirty in the morning we've just started our second watch. Um, bit of a restless night, a bit of creaking in the cabin and but it was a good uh, a good sleep. We've now come back on watch and taken in the Jennica because it was uh, it was getting up to 16 knots of wind, 15, 16 knots of wind, which is just a little bit too much for the Jenny. So we swapped over to the Genoa now, and um, we still maintain over five knots, which is a good speed. We got a lovely full moon last night, which helped 
obviously with vision, but uh, yeah, sea state's not too bad. Um, we've got waves from behind, wind from behind, and uh, should have a good day at this. It's supposed to stay like this all day, maybe increase a little bit, maybe up to 20 knots, but uh, hopefully we should uh, maintain this sort of speed and this sort of, of course. He's downstairs making a cup of tea. <laughs> I felt a little bit seasick last night actually. Um, never really came to anything. Took a tablet and uh, seemed fine after that, so he's down there making a drink now. Um, we tend to use a gas at night, because uh, obviously we've used quite a bit of power over over the course of the last six hours um, with the electronics, the radar, chart pod, etc. So yeah, all good. Supposed to be taking us somewhere in the region of six days to get there, and at this pace, I would guess that's going to be about. Right. So, first night shift done, back on our watch at seven o'clock this morning. Um, immediately as we got back, the wind picked up to 15 knots, and we had Jennifer out. So, the plan was to Tip Jennica down, replace it with the head sail, which we've done. Um, that was our first time taking in the Jennica, so obviously a little bit different. Um, but yeah, all good. The wind has settled intermittently, going between about 12 and about 15. wind speed? Yeah, it's picking up, but I'm keeping an eye on it. We've got the Jenica out. If we have a constant five minutes of between 15 knots and 16 knots, then we'll bring it in. But at the moment it's running good. It's anything between 11 knots and 14 knots. And waves are really picking up. So we've just gone around 10 degrees and it's to stop the slamming between the holes which you get on a catamaran if you're on the side of the waves. It's all going well. You've got a good speed it's that there. It's a beautiful time of night. I know, it's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Some yeah, reflection on the sea. We've got a good speed. Doing, well, you can see we've been going up to 8.2 knots. Yeah, that's But that's surfing down the big waves. Yeah. And we've got a few big waves. All helps. Yeah. 